When I first got into cookie decorating, I thought there was some magical royal icing recipe out there that I was somehow missing. But no matter what recipe I tried, I always fought with bubbles in my icing, and it was so frustrating. Then I realized there's no secret recipe. There's just one super easy trick. Be sure to watch until the end for one more bonus tip. Here's a quick tip before we even begin. I always start by wiping down my bowl and beaters with some white vinegar. The acidity in the vinegar breaks down any traces of fat, which can ruin royal icing. Once everything's clean, we're going to start with three tablespoons of meringue powder. I'm using Jeannie's Dream. Next, here's the trick for bubble-free royal icing every time, and it's so simple. We're going to add one quarter cup of warm water, not hot. But before we do that, let me explain why this is such an important step. Adding warm water to the meringue powder helps activate the proteins in the powder. This allows the proteins to begin unfolding and forming bonds with each other, which creates a network that gives the meringue strength and elasticity. Do not use hot water, though. Too much heat can make the meringue collapse. Also, meringue powder is made from dried egg whites, so we want to avoid cooking it. I heat my water in the microwave for about 10 to 13 seconds until it's just nicely warm to the touch. Next, whisk the meringue powder and warm water together until the mixture becomes frothy. Make sure to scrape the edges of your bowl too. Then add three cups of powdered sugar. To avoid making a huge mess while mixing, start by gently stirring the sugar into the liquid mixture with a spatula. Once slightly combined, use an electric mixer on medium for a couple of minutes until the icing thickens and becomes glossy. You can also use a stand mixer fitted with a paddle attachment. After that, add one half teaspoon of vanilla bean paste or your flavoring of choice and mix on low until just combined. Avoid over mixing or the icing will become grainy. And there you have it, stiff consistency icing that won't be prone to bubbles as you thin it out for various techniques. And now time for that bonus tip. One of the best tips I ever received for controlling your royal icing consistency is to thin it out using a misting spray bottle. This allows you to add just a small amount of water at a time and helps avoid oversaturation which can also cause bubbles. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe.